Hello and welcome to our news magazine from InnoTrans 2012, the world's largest trade fair for transport technology. The rail industry is spread across the globe. However, it's InnoTrans that traditionally brings together the industry's top representatives every other year here in Berlin. The same is true for InnoTrans 2012, with InnoTrans taking place for the ninth time already. Well, and here are our topics. Grand opening. InnoTrans kickoff with high-profile guests in Berlin. Overview. The current highlights of InnoTrans at a glance. And the overall mood. The current trends of the transport industry. Well, these days all eyes of the transport industry are focused on InnoTrans here in Berlin. More than a thousand national and international top representatives of science, politics and economy took part in a grand opening at Palais am Funkturm on September 18th in Berlin. And we were on site for you as well. InnoTrans 2012 opened its gates in Berlin with a perfect blend of show, high-profile guests and future-oriented topics of the transport technology industry. Among the guests were, for instance, Seem Kallas, the Vice President of the European Commission, the German Federal Minister of Transport, Dr. Peter Ramsauer, as well as numerous transport ministers and executives of railway manufacturers and transportation companies from both Germany and abroad. We are putting a great deal of longer-term investment into rail as an essential element of the trans-European transport network. You know, that we are at this stage, this second half of this year, we have really very, very hot debates about the next European multi-annual financial framework, and there is one element particularly important for us, so-called Connecting Europe facility instrument, which in, in, um, in very large amount, in 32 billion euro, is promoting or investing in transport infrastructure during seven years. The rail industry is and will remain a growth engine, which is why it is of major political and economic importance. Furthermore, the positive signal this event is sending is also of great tangible and intangible value for Berlin as a trade fair location. Well, actually, Innotrans um, is part of our big five. Uh, those five shows represent some 80% of our uh, compound turnover at Messe Berlin and therefore it's of utmost importance not only for our company but also for the city because uh, the information that is spread over the world, all over the world from Indotrans is a rather positive one. Indotrans is growing for the last 16 years and um, we are very proud of this specific show. But it is not only the Berlin Trade Fair that can take pride in Innotrans. The exhibiting companies and organizations also appreciate the opportunity for target-oriented networking which Innotrans provides on every occasion. With its slogan, The Future of Mobility, Innotrans 2012 is dedicated to the future of eco-friendly and efficient traffic solutions. This year again, InnoTrans is really a central place for state-of-the-art technology, which becomes apparent not only in the further extension of the exhibition area, but also in the approximately 100 world premieres. And that's why InnoTrans is always an absolute must-go for leading companies of the transport industry. This year's InnoTrans once more provides an opportunity to admire a truly spectacular range of premieres, eagerly observed by numerous trade visitors as well as national and international media representatives. This unique atmosphere is also greatly appreciated by the exhibiting companies. There's no other exhibition in the world that even begins to compare to Innotrans. It marks the most important platform for us, where the whole world meets every other year, whether it's the rail industry or the rail operators. It's a gathering place even for politics, for example, transport ministers. So you can really say Innotrans brings together the expertise from five continents. More than 200 different ministers of transport are currently here. It's really a globally unique event, which takes place every other year for the rail industry and the rail operators. 
It is particularly in the fields of rail-bound transport and locomotive construction that Innotrans presents new developments. For instance, the German national railway company Deutsche Bahn unveiled a full-scale model of the power car for the latest generation of trains, the ICX. Furthermore, the company Bombardier, as an internationally operating provider of transport solutions, has used Innotrans for the presentation of its new Trax F140 diesel multi-engine locomotive. Innotrans is the top meeting point for our entire sector. First of all, we meet all our clients here, but we also meet our suppliers, our business partners. And what I really like of Innotrans is ideas develop here. This is a marketplace where everybody from all over the world is here to create and develop business in the rail sector. Beyond that, the topics at Innotrans are also getting new impetus, not least due to the energy transition and the requirements for eco-friendly passenger and cargo transport. However, not only the challenges of the energy transition, but also many other future-oriented topics, such as the renaissance of the railway, can be found all over the versatile program of events at Innotrans in Berlin. Well, and that rounds it up for our Innotrans TV News magazine, here from the exhibition grounds of the Trade Fair in Berlin. For more information on Innotrans, simply log on to innotrans.com. We'd like to say goodbye to you with some impressions from Innotrans 2012, the world's largest trade fair for transport technology. Thank you very much for watching and goodbye from Berlin.